The Dell XPS 13 is our favorite laptop, and now the company has built a two-in-one version. Can it live up to the original? Certainly, you'll have a hard time telling the XPS 13 2-in-1 from the laptop at a glance. The only dead giveaway is the hinge, which is now a 360-degree rotating design. The exterior and interior are otherwise near identical. It's a good thing, then, that the XPS 13 is still one of the most attractive laptops, and its competitors have been slow to copy it. The 2-in-1's slim profile and soft-touch interior remain unique and even inviting. But don't let the look fool you. Despite its similarities with the original, the XPS 13 2-in-1 makes some major changes. One is the processor. It's a Core i7 7Y75, which uses less power than the Core i7 7500U found in most competitors. Normally, we'd expect that to be a drag on performance, but Dell uses a feature it calls Dynamic Power Mode to temporarily boost wattage. The result is a processor that performed almost as well as the more power-hungry version of Core i7, albeit in short bursts. Anything that stresses the processor will eventually show the chip's limits, but in day-to-day -day use, the laptop felt very quick, thanks not only to Dynamic Power Mode, but also the fast solid-state drive. Now, Dell has reduced the size of the battery from 60 watts to 46 watts, a move the company says was needed to keep the system slim without compromising on keyboard travel or touchpad size. Luckily, the power sipping chip helps to maintain endurance. We measured almost five hours of battery life in our demanding Peacekeeper test, and the Easy HD video loop extended that to 10 hours, 37 minutes. These numbers are on par with the original XPS 13 and better than competitors like the HP Spectre X360 and the Lenovo Yoga 910, despite the fact both of those have bigger batteries. So far, so good, and otherwise, there's not much to complain about. The touchpad could be better, and the display can look dim, but these are minor quibbles. In other areas like the keyboard, the XPS 13 201 really excels. The only major issue is the price. Dell starts the system at $1,000 for a Core i5 processor, 4GB of RAM, and 128GB solid-state hard drive. Now, HP will let you double the memory and hard drive capacity for the same price, or even a little less. The XPS 13 2-in-1's base model is also $200 more than the regular XPS 13 laptop. The price does hold this 2-in-1 back from must-have status, but it's still an excellent all-around device, and probably the one to get if budget isn't your primary concern. 